An unmarried couple bought a house together. Uh, their relationship went south, and they couldn't come to an agreement as to what to do with the property. So they found themselves in court in what's called a partition action uh, in which the judge was going to decide. Now, before they went to court, uh, there was about $100,000 in equity in the home. By the time the case settled, without the matter even getting to trial, uh, the parties owed their attorneys about $50,000. So literally half the equity in the property went to lawyers. Uh, and that was simply because the parties didn't have an agreement in place that addressed what would happen if their relationship ended. But, you know, it didn't need to go that way. Uh, my name is Steve Whitmore, and I'm an attorney with Robinson & Henry. And if you're currently thinking about buying a home with someone, a friend or a family member, you're probably feeling optimistic and excited. You're thinking, you know, if a problem arises, that's fine. We'll work it out. And, and hopefully you will. And hopefully you won't find yourself in a partition case. But maybe you can avoid that altogether. And you can do that by having a, an agreement in place that outlines in detail what's supposed to happen when problems arise. Uh, if you have that, maybe you'll get to keep more of your equity. And maybe you won't have to give that equity to the lawyers. Uh, if you'd like more information about how we can make that happen, reach out to us at robinsonandhenry.com.